Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve a problem where the question is d cube minus 2d square plus 4d minus 8 into y equal to e power 2x plus sin x cos x. Let's rearrange the last term. Since it is a product of two trigonometric terms, it's easy to write in the form of a single term by using the basic trigonometric formula that is sin 2a equal to 2 sin a cos a. So when I bring this 2 to the other side denominator, sin 2a by 2 is sin a into cos a. So this term is replaced by sin 2x by 2 and the rest of the terms are as it is. So e power 2x plus sin 2x by 2. So first part of the solving, we have to write the auxiliary equation where it is m cube minus 2m square plus 4m minus 8 equal to 0. So solving this using calculator, we get three values for m. One is 2 and the other is plus or minus 2i which can be written in the form of 0 plus or minus 2i which is nothing but alpha plus or minus i beta. So alpha is 0 and beta is 2. As for the procedure, we have to write the complementary function. First m value is 2. So c1 e power 2x. Then e power alpha x, alpha is 0. Then c2 cos beta x, beta is 2. Plus c3 sin 2x. Now, this can be written as c1 e power 2x. Anything about 0 is 1. So leaving that term, rest of the terms should be written as it is. Now complementary function is completed. Coming to the particular integral 1. The first term we have here is e power 2x. So e power 2x divided by d cube minus 2d square and we have to copy the full equation plus 4d minus 8. Now we have to substitute wherever d is there 2. So it is going to be e power 2x by 2 cube 8. Here if I put 2, 2 square 4, 4 to 8 minus 8 then again plus 8 minus 8. All the terms get cancelled in the denominator and we get 0. When denominator becomes 0, we have to multiply the numerator by x and differentiate denominator. So let's put x into e power 2x. When I differentiate d cube, which is 3d square minus 4d and differentiation of plus 4d is plus 4. Now once again we have to substitute the value of ds2. So it is going to be x into e power 2x divided by 2 square 4, 4, 3, 12 minus 8 plus 4. Totally the denominator is 8. So x e power 2x by 8. Now p8 2. This is nothing but sin 2x by 2 whole divided by d cube minus 2d square plus 4d minus 8. So as per the procedure d square should be replaced as 2 square with a minus sign outside. So numerator is half sin 2x. And denominator d cube can be written as d into d square. So d into d square is 2 square with a minus sign outside. Then minus 2 into 2 square with a minus sign outside. So I make this as plus. Wherever d square is there, we are putting 2 square with a minus sign outside and the rest of the terms as it is. Now half sin 2x whole division 
this 4d and this is minus 4d it cancel this is 8 and minus 8 so we get 0 in the denominator the denominator is 0 multiply numerator by x and differentiate denominator so numerator is half sin x sorry half sin 2x then differentiation gives 3d square minus 4d plus 4 now once again wherever d square is there we have to substitute 2 square with minus sign outside so half sin 2x whole division now 3 into d square is 2 square with minus sign outside minus 4d plus 4 now once again numerator as it is and we have to multiply with x also here as per the procedure so we have x into half sin 2x whole divided by minus 4d and this will become minus 12 then this is plus 4 so totally minus 8 you can take minus sign common so minus x by 2 sin 2x and we can take 4 also common so it become d plus 2 and we have to multiply by its conjugate d minus 2 so numerator minus x by 2 let's multiply sin 2x inside so d sin 2x minus 2 sin 2x whole division 4 into d square minus 4 now wherever d square is there we have to put 2 square with a minus sign outside so this will be minus x by 2 d stand for differentiation differentiation of sin 2x is cos 2x into 2 then minus x by 2 I have to multiply here plus x by 2 into 2 sin 2x now whole division you have to substitute d square as 2 square with a minus sign outside and we have minus 4 now further simplifying this we get these two get cancelled these two gets cancelled so minus x cos 2x then plus x sin 2x then four division this is minus 4 minus 4 so minus 8 then into 4 minus 32 now we have to combine cf and pa for getting the complete solution so we have two pa pa1 and pa2 now cf is c1 e power 2x plus c2 cos 2x plus c3 sin 2x then pi1 where we have x into e power 2x by 8 let's write it here x into e power 2x by 8 then minus 1 by 32 bracket open minus x cos 2x plus x sin 2x